Okay, so we start from the beginning again. Go down to base color. And now we're going to get, let's do the stone. So select the stone texture again, drag it into there. Choose main input tweak, select that. Here we have our stone, it looks all very a bit bumpy. Looks pretty cool actually. <laughs> um, okay, so let's just fit this on there so we can see it there. That's quite harsh. And we just do the same again. So we go through a process, we select our resolution like that. And immediately we get more detail. I'm not liking the way that they all look a bit rounded. Oh, it's very nice. I do like that texture. It's come across really well. Um, yep, that's all done. And just work your way down through these. Um, setting up the values, you know, what's you know, what you feel is good. I'll do the same, but I might do this on fast forward because you've already seen me do it for the for the earth. So this time I'm going to be on a little bit fast forward and then the next two I'm going to let you do. So you can do your own, you can do the last two, you can do the grass and the leafy one. Um, so let's get started. <laughs> see I spent quite a lot of time on this one and it's because I'm not quite happy with the way it's created these light elements inside in between the stones and I'm trying to get rid of it um, like that quite like that that's quite cool it's coming out quite nice but it could be a problem um, I don't want to cancel the light because it's so let's just take this up a little bit let's make it a little bit patchy yeah I don't want, don't want those areas to be too dark And then we can maybe up the luminosity of it a little bit. <clears throat> you can see what the base color is going to look like. There's no shadows in there. It's just sort of grungy patches and dirty patches. But the actual 
finished thing looks really cool. Yes, that's much better. And that'll blend with our earth texture really well. Show through the stones. All this, these little sort of roots that are sticking out are quite nice. Okay, so I'm quite happy with that for now. And I want to spit them out. So, again, go to export as bitmap. We've got already got these set up from our last export, so that's all we need. We've got to change, this time we've got to change the, uh, to stones, go into this folder. And we're going to select it. And here we're just going to change that to stones. Percent U, TGA, click export. Ding, ding, ding. Close. So if you go into your terrain, stones folder, and there they are. You got the three maps. You know, so that's that's how you do it. Basically, using bitmap to material. There's no magic buttons. It's a really simple application. So what we want you to do now is to do the other two, and then where we apply them in unity i want to i'll show you my my textures that i've created for my grass and for my leafy base so we'll have all four done ready to apply in unity so i'll see you in the next lecture